Alrighty everybody, welcome back to your Lexington Racers here in Legend Bowl. Uh, last episode, I went for a kind of more of a commentary style and decided that was not something I was going to do. It's a little, it's, it's, speaking with Indy Y after the, after the episode, it was uh, a lot more difficult to do than I had originally kind of thought to do while I'll try to play and win. So we're going to go back to the way I, I was doing. Uh, for those of you catching up last episode, who didn't catch it, um, last episode was a little brutal. Uh, not, not, not our best game by a long shot. Uh, but definitely uh, a win, which is what we needed. Uh, beating Baltimore in a contested game, but yeah, uh, you know, 20 to 13, multiple turnovers, zeros, putting the ball on the ground twice, two fumbles. Got a, what was it, 98 yards or 101 or something like that. And unfortunately, just not being able to really. Uh, get the ball rolling the way we had been. Uh, defense came in huge, though. Got a fumble recovery for a touchdown on a kickoff. And then had a second fumble recovery on uh, an offensive play. Big, huge uh, stop by the defense and a stop by our special teams. They finally stepped up. My kicking abilities have still been atrocious. Uh, passing... Uh, I've got to do a better job making better decisions as a passer. Andy White's got to throw better passes. And our receivers have got to get some hands, cause, yeah, it, it's it's been rough. Um, look at the stats for the league so far, league leaders. Uh, Indy Y, his stats for the year, his rating is eighty point two, putting him in near the bottom of the league at eighty point two with uh, a twenty eight out of thirty three. Uh, he's twenty three for fifty five for forty one percent pass completion, uh, which is going to put him. Uh, at 30, so he's near the bottom of class with pass completion. And not not great on receiving. His yards are 11. He's had a couple big plays, but just, uh, yeah, definitely definitely not uh, been the best uh, passing season so far. So, got to do better there. Rushing-wise, Zero still leading the league uh, at, three, at 48 attempts for 361 yards. Miles in second at 220. Uh, he's averaging 8 per carry, which is a Stupidly in solid number. If you're averaging that in a real game, yeah, that's something that's long of 42. Miles being our breakout guy, coming in second, but he's been breaking out those big runs, 50, 60 yard runs. Just every game he has that one big run that just, just kind of like, oh wow, okay, this is why this guy gets some reps. Uh, zeros with three TDs so far, had one last week, but he did put it on the ground twice last week. Two fumbles. Uh, just so one of which we lost, which was just, just crushing. Uh, wide receiver wise, receptions. Reaver actually has seven. He's he's been our most consistent at receiver when it comes to catches, sort of. But as you can see, he only has 69 yards. Nice. I don't know that he's going to get more. He may not catch another ball all season. Conveniently. Uh, let's see, who, do we have anybody higher than him for yardage? Uh, Monk actually has 84. Last week, I think he had one reception. Um, last, last, last week, <laughs> last game, I should say, last week, it was actually recorded yesterday. Uh, just, yeah, not great. Not great at all. But this is where we've been well. Our defense has been nuts. Anoni leading the league, or second in the league, I'm sorry, with 17 tackles. But leading the league in those tackles for loss and has two pass flex. Just just absolutely getting it done. Well, Winston Riley got two P got three tackles for loss and a sack. Big play last week. Come on down here. SKS getting on the stat sheet, but SKS is hurt. Tore a hamstring last week, out like nine weeks. So big loss there in the front. He's one of our best players and just gonna be out for the rest of the season. Most of the season. So, definitely a big loss there. Omakadan getting a huge fumble recovery last week. Jumped on it right there at the end to kind of help seal that victory. Got one tackle for loss this season. Not played as well as far as tackles and so forth, but definitely being that kind of point man. And, you know, made a big play last week. Got to give him credit there. He's the old guy on the team at 42. So, yeah, definitely can step up on that some stuff. Can step up there a little bit. Z Striker. Z Striker had. Z Striker. I don't find him. I don't even know if he's got listed for a tackle. Tackles he's got. Um, I don't think he should be there somewhere. Uh, 
Well, well, anyway. There he is. Five tackles and one for loss. But his QB hurries this season have been massive. Those rushes off that end, he's got amazing speed. Um, as you can see, 85 speed. Just Dude just blitzes that line. And then we ain't going to look at things like kicking. Because, God help me. But enough yammering. We'll come back to that next, uh, next couple weeks. We'll check back on where we are. But this week, we're going to play Kansas City. Let's see what the league... Uh... Oh, I didn't want... Wrong button. Wrong button. There we go. This week, week four, we are playing Kansas City at home, back in Lexington. Uh, but you can see the other games. Arizona at Seattle, Tampa Bay at Baltimore, San Diego affiliate Sandy, Denver at Detroit, Pitt at San Francisco, Indy. You see all these big, huge games. But we're playing, I believe, a night game, it looks like. We might be playing a night game. Sim all those, see what we get. Coming away at home, playing the, wearing the white unis. Gonna look fresh. Let's see what we got. I gotta do better with the uh, the passing attempts and so forth. Loving the blue green field. I, after being told that was in there and going back and looking at it, yeah, I actually am happy with that. You see, eat your beanies. You know, you got your beanies. Taco triangles, both sponsoring our game here. Seventy-seven, the high of, with a win for to four. That's actually about what's going to be today here in Kentucky. Just a little warmer. I think about eighty, so a couple of degrees hotter, but solid day. Getting to the Coin toss here. Let's see. Coyotes. And Coyotes will kick. We've lost the coin toss. First time all season we've lost the coin toss. Uh, last week we chose to kick the ball. Or we chose to receive the ball first. Trying to jumpstart the offense. And that that didn't go so well. Uh, that didn't go well at all. Especially in the, first, the second half. Because we missed out on an opportunity for points. On a zero uh, fumble, if I recall. We'll let Sock just touch that one back. And we'll come out on the 20. Zero fumbling the ball going into halftime last week, as I recall, in the last game. Really uh, just wasn't what we were hoping for, to say the least, because we looked like we were going to get some points. And instead, he, he puts on the ground. But you know what? He came and made a huge play and, and the conversion, the two-point conversion. Oh, and then he gets a big hole here. Oh, tried to spin move just a little too early on that spin, though. Big, massive run. Looks like he's in the mood to make a big play. 12-yard run. If he, if I can get him running like that all game, we're in good shape. Uh, let's let's try this pass. I did, a, did about a minute or two of practice. I think I've got to be much more accurate. I think it requires the game to be much more accurate on the passes. Oh, I wanted to spin back inside. Okay, remember, this isn't Madden. This is Legend Bowl. Not that I'm playing the new Madden, because I would rather hang myself. Uh, I shouldn't make that joke, but it, the new Madden is absolutely atrocious. It is. There isn't many games I would rather play. I would. I would. I, I would. You, there's not many scenarios where I'd see myself playing that. And apparently, Kansas City's rush defense is apparently going to be atrocious. I'm going to take it. I didn't look at their stats team wise. I'm just going to play the game's asses and not worry about what they're good and bad at and just play them. I probably should have. Zero is getting a little tired out there already. So, hopefully. Over the middle to Reaver. Coming up, making about a seven yard catch. I got him, they gave him six, about six and a half there. A solid catch there. Indy White coming out, slinging the ball pretty well. Got it. You know what? Maybe that's what he needed. He just needed me to actually practice a little bit and play against a, good, a bad team. Oh, oh, no! Oh, that first drop of the day. He had it, and he just dropped it. McMahon, you know, this is why we don't give you the ball. Oh, there we go. Oh, no, zeros getting stopped. Uh, fourth and five. Not liking this. But I think I'm going to go for it here. I think I can make this run with a halfback toss to the power side. We ran the ball so well. Oh, there we go. Oh, get out there. Oh, Zero's breaking free on the fourth down play. And the spin move. Yeah, huge run right there. Zero's packing. I had a feeling he's looking like he's going to be dangerous today. Because I guess it's Kansas City defense. You know what? I think he's got a chance to, to play well. Thank God. <laughs> After last week, I think he's uh, he's a little upset about last week. 
Oh, Miles with the catch out of the backfield. Actually, wouldn't have the backfield. I guess he was lined up as a flanker. Solid play there. Uh, let's run up in the inside. Miles giving Miles the ball. He's not much of an inside runner. He's much more of a, a kind of a change of pace back, basically. That's the way I kind of look at him. But he breaks it free. My God, our blocking has been amazing. Ooh, tried to spin. Another huge run. May not throw the ball much. This <laughs> Indy White may not have many passes this game, just based on what I'm seeing here from this team. But uh, you know what? Whatever gets us the win. Oh, that is not going to get us the win as Kruger is dropped. <laughs> Man, apparently they apparently somebody has paid. Apparently the offensive line is upset with Kruger. Uh, Man on that double, on that triple move. Basically, uh, we're not going to look that way. Captain Pete up there, nice, nice little five-yard gain. So we'll go with that. Uh, like a slant. Or there we go. All slants. Here we go. Reaver, everybody coming in. I like Reaver. I like sock puppet on that left-hand side. Although I don't like that linebacker sitting there. Oh, got swatted the line. Oh, so close, and then the passing game let us down. Do I percentage? Hey, sixty-six point seven is better than I've done all season. <laughs> I wish I was like a target here. I was talking to Andy Y about this. You kind of got to know where you're aiming. Um, just instinctually. I wish it was like a target. Like, hey, this is where the go posts are. Like, just just a little shadow go post. Okay, so I kind of see. Okay, oh, I'm aiming at this point. So I need to kick here to get a solid kick. Um, but, okay. Oh, a little overpowered. Boing. It's going to come up short. It's going to drop at about the 15. So, not, not terrible. Kick. Stevenson, free safety coming up and making a hit. Yeah, not bad. They're going to start the 30, but our defense is pretty good. Hopefully we can do that. I like this cover two blitz. With zero, with Z Star coming off the edge, our defensive line isn't nearly as good as it is with S I got SKS in there. Maybe. Nobody come up and play in the wood. After a five yard gain, probably should come out in a base, like in a zone, maybe. Because I got a feeling Kemp coming in playing right tackle. Uh, or right defensive end, I'm sorry. In place of the injured SKS. Oh, a Mac Well, Macadan had a chance at it, but came up a little short there, buddy. Definitely uh, definitely going to hurt us up front with, with our players being, with SKS being hurt with a, a hamstring, too. Oh. I could even get the tackle there, I think. Look like. Oh, McCall, our left, our left defensive tackle, get the tackle there. Although that was pretty bundled up everywhere on that one. So, gotta say, defense picking them, playing well, and that's a booming kick. Sock puppet gonna have to go a long way for that one. Oh, Sock puppet tried to spin. Uh, yeah, didn't get much. I'm not great at the returning game either. I run the ball well. But that's about it. I have good play calling. I'm an offensive coordinator, not a not a head coach. All right, we're gonna. Do. Oh, there we go. Exactly what I want to do. Spin to the inside, and zero's getting. Oh, come on, ah, oh, run out of gas. I got work on his stamina. Uh, yeah, need some things to get his stamina. 54 yards on four rushes. He has half as many yards in this game so far than he did all last week. And now we go to Miles. That's a little midline run, uh, although we may change it up for a quick pass. I kind of like the idea of just a quick pass here. Or maybe a standard pass. A little block in there. Sock on that post, maybe? Miles coming across. Monk out there. Ooh, Monk on that. Oh, no! That was, yeah. I, I, I want a little more oomph on that pass, but what can you do? We'll, uh, oh, no, we are not doing that. Ranger, Ranger, Ranger. We're out of the backfield with the, uh, the little screen pass. Not, not really what I was looking for today, but I, was, I didn't realize it was going to be Kruger getting that ball. I thought we had that. What do I have for audibles? Uh, let's, let's run slants. 
Oh, Reaver over. Oh, no! Reaver! You had the first down! Like, be a man! Take the hit and just get on with it. Alright, we're gonna go for this. I like our defense enough that I think we can we can hold them here. Oh, that's that's definitely not what we want. Ah, oh. yeah, yeah, not not what I intended for that. Then I saw I just happened to see the defender, and it's like that's that's bad. So, yeah, definitely. Uh, Not what I hoped for on that play. I should have just ran the ball. I did that little slant play. But yeah, that was uh, definitely bad. Come on, man, call the play. That wasn't uh, also, again, not a great play there either. Well, uh, the little base zone here. Noda's been kind of quiet today so far. He ain't got a tackle yet, I don't think. Or maybe one or two. Oh, but uh, there's... I can't tell who that was. I'll have to look here in just a second. Let's bring uh, Z Striker off that one. That was uh, McCall again. Making making big plays. Oh, we're right up the middle. Z Striker with the tackle. So that blitz actually worked out for us. Let's bring that outside fire cover too. I like that. I like this one a lot. It gives us that deep coverage while having everybody manned up underneath. So I think that gives us a, a little bit of, well, giving us a little bit of zone, a rush, and our right, our backup defensive end coming in for SKS, Kemp coming in and getting a tackle uh, on the QB, kind of scrambling there. So big play there by Kemp. You know, SKS out hurt, would have been in there, might have been different play, never know. Sock puppet coming up with the with the ball, but not getting too many yards. Nine yards. Sock getting leveled every single time he gets that ball in the kickoff from that punt, so you yeah, definitely have to do something about that. No, Kirker, I don't want you to have the ball. Here go. Zeros to that one. There we go. A little toss play to the outside. Oh! Kruger, bad at blocking. If it had turned out, we'd have had probably eight yards, but instead he... God only knows what he was doing. So... Ooh, Zero's getting a little tired there, but not terrible. Oh, oh, NDY gonna run the ball here and get about three. Breaking two yards, two and a half. Uh, his first run of the season. I I pulled it. It's like it looked covered. I'm like I'm just gonna pull it and go. And NDY not fast at all. Uh, so I remember that. Oh, and he way overthrew that one. Wow. Indy Y having to start out hot and then just has somebody threw some ice water on him because he has played poorly since. Ooh, that's gonna be a bad kick, it looks like. Sock will be getting down there though. Oh. Get off him. Ooh, can't tell who made that hit. Samson. Uh 15 yard uh run back. Uh, I like the idea. A base zone here, just because I got a feeling they're probably going to run this ball. And I'd like to have the men up front. Oh. Simpson jumping up there, getting the tackle. Solid play there. Uh, give him credit there. I, they threw it over their, our heads. I was certain uh, they were going to run the ball in that scenario, but they, they fooled me on that one. I, I wasn't thinking about the fact that it is that late in the quarter. So, it's actually not that late. There's still two minutes, and they got all timeouts, so they could definitely have, uh... Oh, Beard coming up and just Bard. Is it Bard or Beard? I mean, is it Bard? Does he play a loot? Uh, I'm calling Beard for now, but I gotta check his name. Uh, some, some of the players who I didn't put in the game, I'm not as familiar with. Still, even three games in. Four games in now. I should, I should make a point to learn their names, but I'm also terrible with names. Ooh. Had to make some changes here, guys, for the... Trying to get picked apart here. We've got to do something. Uh, ain't sure on this, actually, Trick for Toad. You know what? Cover one. Dagger? Yeah, good C Striker on that, uh, that rush there. Ooh. They called timeout. Well, they waited a long time to do that, let me tell you. 
Uh, I don't know that I'd have done that, but hey, that's that's me. I'd have probably called it a little before then, like when the ball was down. Oh, nice swat right there. And by swat, I mean turn around and get it bounced off your forehead. But hey, we'll take what we get, right? I'm not going to complain as long as they don't get yardage. A uh, little zone opening there in front of Z-Striker, but hopefully we can get some pressure on the quarterback here. Oh. You know who that was? Again, I wasn't sure who that was. I wish they had, like, numbers or name plates or something like that. I could at least try and figure out who's who. Let's, uh... Like, cover two with the blitzer. There's a, there's a timeout again. Waiting a long time for these timeouts. I'm not... Yeah. So... Kind of interesting on that one. Cover one robber. And Zerker coming off that corner. We've got three down linemen. Probably could come with a 2D bat. Oh. oh, get it, get it! Oh, come on, man. Yeah. You stood back there like it was a punt. Steve hasn't had it. And he just stood back there like, buddy, all you do is put your hands up and catch it. I know you're a DB, but you can still catch. Hopefully. And that one was good. He kicked that one well. So, we got about a minute left. Uh, gonna maybe score some points. 48 seconds, I'm sorry. Need a big return here for any. Gonna do that. And I'm not very good at that. But, let's see what we can't do here. Stop it, we're gonna run up, te level the, uh, ow. That was not what I'd hoped for. Level the, uh, wide receiver there, or the, uh, uh the referee there. Um, uh, got this one. I like Reaver on that post. I like Zeros out of the backfield here, too. Oh! Terrible pass. I, uh, yeah, that was bad. That was really bad. I liked it. It didn't like me. Oh. Oh, Reaver. With the, uh, the first down. There we go. 30 seconds left. Um, shotgun pass. 689 hook. I like that. Reaver, a long run. Oh, that was bad. That was really bad. Over through that one by a country mile. That was on me. That I, I can't even... I thought I had a lot less time than that. Spot and go. Oh, that was bad too. Uh, just terrible. Absolutely terrible. I've got to practice something like that. I just, I really do. Miles, fourth down, but we're going to go for it here. Call a timeout. I get another big play out of this. I'm going to punt. Shotgun pass. Double ends. I like, I like the idea of this one. All right, so sock puppet. Oh, no! Ah! He had it! No reason why he should have had it. Cover up everybody here. He had that. Ugh. Terrible. Terrible by me. Oh, no! That was entirely my fault. I tried to jump the route. And at halftime, I give him a play. So we're down seven, and we don't get the ball back. So, yeah, that was terrible play by that decision by me. Y'all can blame that one on me. The coach made some bad calls there. So, yeah, uh, definitely not not the best. So the stats are at halftime. At halftime, they're leading. We have six first downs to their three. 
total yards. They have 90 yards passing, most of that on that one play. Uh, we have that five rushing yards. We have 84. We're averaging a lot, but we've got to run the ball. Here. I've been attempting to pass the ball, and that has got me hurt again. Just got to run the ball, put it on the ground, give it to Zeros, let him rumble, and an attempt to try and get Indy wide and have a good game. I just I'm really hurting the team badly. Oh, there we go. There we go. Throw the 20. So. That was, yeah. End of the half was entirely my fault. Just blame the coach on that one. Alright, what a... Oh, nice play. Beard, come back with the... Solid play there. I'll take that one uh, all day of the week. Cover two man with a blitzer. Is a striker over here coming in on the, uh, the outside? See what he can't do. Oh. Oh, nice deflection there. You know, he's not having a great game, but compared to how I've done with NDY, yeah, he's having a lot better than me. I can't, you know, I can't, I can't throw shade on this one. Like, I'm gonna be honest. I've had a couple of opportunities to get in the backfield. I just haven't done it. Oh, Bobble. There we go. Fourth down. All right, good. Defense came out. Gave us a stop. Uh, yeah, at least they're playing well. Barring that one massive play, which was entirely my fault. Even, I, I can't even justify and call a lag. Indy White told me I can't blame myself. i got to blame the lag or the controller. Them's the rules, and I can't even... I can't do that on this one. Sorry, bud. It's it's entirely my play calling and inability. We're gonna we're gonna hand the ball off, and actually we're gonna pitch it. But same thing. Oh, wow, that was. You know, we passed the ball very poorly, and we ran the ball very well. And I'm afraid we're not gonna run the ball very well either. So. Oh. I had him! I had him. Third and 17. Just, yeah. I, yeah, there are no words for how bad this is going right now. Oh, beautiful pass. Right up to Reaver. Third and... Alright, here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna pitch this ball to the outside. And we're gonna try and pick this ball up. I'm gonna run this to the left. There we go. I like the idea of running this to the left into the open field. Oh, there we go. There we go. Oh, zeros. Get around the corner, buddy. Get around the corner. Come on. Oh. Reaver picking up the ball. Zeros third. I spun and he drops it. Dude, you gotta hold on. I want to pull you. But you're leading the league, but you've also got three fumbles now. Three in the last three games, like... Oh, wow, but I couldn't get back inside. I wanted to spin him back inside, and that didn't work. Alright, so... Halfback stretch. Zeros looking a little tired here. Get some blockers outside. Oh, get up the outside, buddy. Go, go! Come on, Zeros! Make that turn! Go! Up the field! Get in there! Yes! Touchdown! Zero's running it in for the touchdown, even though he did fumble the ball earlier. But, thank gosh. That fourth down play, uh, gutsy, but yeah. Shanked it. Still good, but definitely need to work on my kicking, too. Game's all tied up. Uh,. We are playing with the Seattle Seahawks of the NFL because uh, we're into that heartbreak thing. Because there is no explanation for how badly uh, my kicking game is been terrible. I've got to, I've got to do better. Uh, <laughs> oh boy, not uh, not the game I was hoping to have. I was, 
We started out the game so well, I'm like, oh yeah, that's gonna be great. I'm actually gonna have some. Oh, oh, not good. Galvin, get out there. Oh, thank God for Stevens. Otherwise, that would have been a, uh, yeah. That would have been ugly, to say the least. It was like it was gonna get ugly anyway, so. Uh, yeah. Oh, there we go. Uh, Noni, second tackle of the day. Noni kind of had a quiet day. Uh, definitely not his best day, that's for sure. He's a lot better defender than that, uh, gotta be honest. I mean, my gosh, he's second in the NFL in tackles and first in tackles for loss. But, yeah, today he's been kind of quiet in that middle linebacker position, but could be the team. I mean, we are facing a team that likes to throw the ball a lot, and so that could be it. And can't say exactly what's caused it, but... Ooh. Oh, Stevenson coming up making the fourth down stop, although a lot closer than it needed to be. Nine yards. Back there, recurring it. Let's see if we can't get a, a return here. Minute, th minute, four, about a minute 40 left in the quarter. Right, we're just going to let that one go out of bounds. Zero, 71 yards and one TD for the day. Miles, 28 yards and zero TDs. Indy wide, two yards, no touchdowns. He, he read that one rather slow run, we'll call it. Uh, minute 47 left. Zeros, the stretch play to the outside again. Oh, oh, he's got daylight. He's got Greenfield. Go, Zeros. Go, buddy. Come on. No. Oh, we're running out, we're running out of bounds. Save the fumble. Oh, buddy. If you couldn't run, if you didn't run out of the gas, you'd have made it. Oh, uh, that hurt. That hurt a lot. Uh, quick pass at... Oh, there we go. Miles, go. Go, buddy. Oh, I was trying to spin move and, and do that, but yeah, that worked. Nine yard reception. One of, one of the best receptions all day. Uh, we'll inside run this. Halfback drag. Uh, zero. It's just up the gut. Right off the center guard. The combo there. Oh, there we go. Oh, zero. It's coming up. Making a big play there, though. Need two. Getting 12. Get his two first downs, basically. <laughs> I don't think that's how that works. I don't think he gets counted for two, but a little counterplay here, hopefully. Oh, come on in. Oh, we got blocked down field. Monster block. Miles breaking free, and he's gonna be in the end zone. Yes, another big play, another big run. Miles coming in. He does that every game. He has those massive breakout runs. Once a game, he gets a good yard run. And I don't know what it is. I don't know what drives that. But definitely, uh, definitely something about his skill, just showing that he can he can make that play. Oh, got a shank, and it's still good. So, hey, at least Donaldson hasn't missed an extra point yet. Uh, I say that as he will miss the next one probably because I'm terrible at this. Oh, hundred percenter, nice kick right down the center. I said I went for a left return and it went right in the center. So. Yeah. Oh, Kemp. I think it was Kemp. Yeah. Nice kick. Didn't even get to the 20. Didn't even get... Yeah, well, whatever. We'll, we'll do what we can. Recall. Yeah, then. Stacking the line. Looks like a heavy formation. Oh. Oh. Quick pass over the center. Getting pretty much in all the traffic. Every player was right there. I'm not sure... I'm not sure throwing that ball was the best decision, but then again... I'm not great at throwing the ball either. Let's just think a little different. Uh, Z-Striker and Stevenson on a blitz here. Leaving that right side open a little bit. Oh. Oh, wow. I don't know who that was coming. Made the play, but that could have gotten bad. I thought that could have, yeah, that could have, that could have gotten real bad. I got nothing else for that one. It's like, ooh, dodged a board there. See if I got this corner. Oh. Oh. 
Back and getting back there, causing the pressure again. We're great at getting pressure, just cannot get home with those sacks. I don't know if we need what what what's causing that, but just a, a little more speed up front, maybe, or something. I'm not entirely certain what's causing our uh, our lack of ability to to get home on those sacks. Oh, massive run here by Sock. Whoa, huge run with that and that spin move. 29 yards, probably one of his best all season. Huge run there. Just, yeah. Gotta take it. I'll take it. Nice sweep to the outside. Zeros. Oh, oh, up in the up in the gut. Walkers downfield. Oh, Zeros trying to spin back inside. Just didn't make it. 125 rushing yards today. Solid numbers. Uh, would have a lot more had I been smart. And uh, and actually gave him the ball a little bit more often in that first half. And probably would have been way ahead. But hey, you know what? I, you ain't here because I'm smart. You're here because I'm dumb. So, speaking of that, I'd like to thank everybody who's been watching. And the, the series has been usually way more popular than I thought it would be. Uh, more people have been watching it than I had ever anticipated. So, everybody who's been watching it and out there, uh, thank you so much. The feedback's been great. I uh, hope you all have been enjoying it as much as I am. And Zeros is not enjoying that run. That was, uh, that was really bad. Okay. Now we got to throw the ball. Uh, so, but thank you everybody who's, who's been watching. It's been awesome. I've been enjoying it. The day like this. I look forward to this every morning. Oh! Oh, good with the... Oh, solid throw there. I uh, thought it was going to be a bad pass. Uh, but yeah, so... But thank you all for, for coming out and just watching the videos. Uh, it's been phenomenal. Uh, and I have been enjoying this series a ton. And this game is worth, it's like $15 on Steam, worth every penny. And there goes Zeros, in for the touchdown. Another big run. I should have just given the ball all game. NDY should have never thrown a single pass all game. Because apparently, Kansas City does not have a rush defense, and I should have looked at that. <laughs> so, but yeah, uh, thank you all. It's been... It's... Oh. oh, still good. I thought I was going to, I thought I was going to jinx it. So, but if you haven't gone out and picked up this game, do it. It is absolutely a blast. I think it's a fantastic game. Um, it has its shortcomings. I'm not gonna lie, there there are things about it I wish you know were different. Uh, but it's still a fun game. Like it's still a very very fun game to play. The season's great. I, I hope they take this game and do more with it, like a second edition or second edition. My D&D coming through there. Second edition, uh, but a second, like a sequel with some like longer franchise series. An you know, opportunity to add like multi, multi year franchises and, and extra features and more. And taking it to that next level, I, I think would be absolutely awesome. And I think, I think you could. I think you could do a lot of neat things. Definitely a franchise mode that carries over year to year would be great. Oh. Oh, wow. That was... Zero's almost at the sack, and then we give up a first down. So, yay. Like, how how can we not? Um, yeah, I really hope they uh, they do a second uh, game of this, because I think this game has been a ton of fun. And hopefully it's add some extra features, things we want to see. Oh. So, Quentin Glass, 19 pass attempts today, and he's done... I want to say poorly, but he's not done completely terrible. I mean, they were beating us at one point by 10 to nothing, but that's more my own stupidity and our inability to, you know, make a play when we had to. Ooh, ooh, wow, and a nice big play. Made the sack last, or had the tackle last week that Omakadam picked back up, I believe. So, huge, huge play there by him. But yeah, I hope in the next one they have like a franchise mode and, and so forth. So and an ability in the season where I can add my I can add custom players. Oh, zeros coming off or Z Stranger coming off the edge with the sack. Big huge play. Oh boy, that was nice. Huge drop. Uh, that's not what they're gonna do. They ain't kicking that ball. I'm gonna call time out there because that was gonna get bad. Uh, yeah, I'd like to see. That's the thing I'd like to see is the ability for 
for my team to like being able to kind of go all right so I've got this team I want to take him you know two three four five seasons deep and we lost down at the five that was a great kick that would be something to be awesome and, or the ability to add players after the season starts. Like, right now, I can't... If one of you all want to be a player, I can't add you all. Because the season's already started, the roster's already set. So I can't, like, rename a player as you all. And I'm talking about, like... I'm not talking about changing the stats. I'm not just changing the name. It would be awesome. Um, there might be a way of doing it. Uh, but as far as I can tell, I haven't seen it. And it looks like as you change the roster... When, it, when you load the roster... A road of the season, it loads the roster that you used. And then any changes you made to the roster beforehand don't count. Oh, there we go. Zeros. Go, buddy. Go, buddy. Go. Um, so, yeah, I, I would like to be able to see that. Because I would like to be able to add people after the season starts. Make changes to players' names at least. Um, which which might come in the next one. Or if we get a, like a franchise mode. I, what I want to plan on doing is doing an RP system, basically, Sorry. where uh, I'll have to RP the fact that the players are getting name changes because they're, you know, new players and we've traded them. And I might, what I plan on doing is, like, taking names and maybe adjusting some stats a little bit so that the player may not be quite the same. Maybe making some teams better, some teams worse. To kind of, you know, act as a change of season. So, you know, maybe this year the Emeralds are you know, pretty bad. Maybe next season they'll be a pretty strong team. Uh, or the week after, the, you know, the year after that. Or we'll make changes and stuff like that. And so, if you want to be part of the game, and part of the players, you're, you're free for to put down there. And I will uh, definitely be adding people for next season. I'm also thinking t on Thursday morning, after I get off work, doing a live stream of this game. I know I said I was going to do a live stream the other day. I didn't get a chance to. Um, but tomorrow morning I should be able to have time to do a live stream where basically I'm going to be taking the worst team possible and wow, okay. Um, that, that happened. Is there, can I see that again? Okay, watch this. Slow-mo. Wow, okay. Uh, I can't go back. Uh, okay. Huh. Okay, so clearly the replay system isn't working. Uh, let's go back to that. So you see the step back, throw the pass. It bounces off the defender. Rivera coming in. Coming in with the pass. Uh, fish turner off the bench, buddy. You know, first touchdown of the season for him. Huge play. I'll take it. You know what? We gotta have some breaks come our way soon once in a while. Oh, that's gonna be bad. Yeah. And gotta pay attention to the re replay. Wasn't paying attention to that. Just yeah. All right, that's okay. Thirty to ten. Uh, I'm definitely sure the betting line was not that far apart, so I don't think it's gonna matter in the long run. Oh, that did say coming up, making the play. Minute 52 left in the game. Hopefully uh, we can make a play or two. You know what? I'm going to go linebacker fire. We're just going to go for, we're gonna go for it, buddy. Let's see if we can get that quarterback. Oh, quick pass. Quarterbacks in this game really get rid of that ball quick when uh, you put the pressure on them. They, they don't like having you come at them, so... The sack seemed to be a little bit of a challenge, but got one. Z Striker with his first sack, I believe, of the season. Even though I have rushed the crap out of him, uh, blitzed the crap out of him on that Roger on that uh, rubber blitz, but definitely a solid sack on that one. That was that was beautiful. Just, and I can't believe they ran the ball down down twenty. I guess I can believe it. Down twenty, you just kind of like, all right, let's get this over with. Maybe you shouldn't be that way, but oh, Anoni trying to catch up. Oh, Anoni got him, I think. Defense, 
that's, that's their last time out. So, I believe he stayed. Well, he didn't stay. He stayed in bounds, but they had called down. So that didn't matter. Right, Sea striker coming off the inch. Oh, I dove too far in there. Z miss. Z missed his tackle. If he did, you know, did the proper bits blitz like he's supposed to do. Uh, but yeah, he didn't. Another blitz off the injury. Z. I think Z uh, might be able to get to him this time. Oh no! Oh, Samson had a chance at that one, buddy. You know, put your hands up there again. Oh, no, that's Samson. Um, Stevenson on that one. On that one. Can't keep my own player straight. The, the, the generated name players I don't remember well because I don't know them. <laughs> And as I said, I'm terrible with names. So, remembering people who I don't know is hard. And especially when I can figure out who they are on the field because they all look reasonably close to the same. Well, let's see what happens here. Should have known it. Should have called timeout, but oh well. Still a 14-point game. Uh, hurts us on the defensive yardage thing. That's something I wish the game was smart about. Like, it's like suggesting me to go and play defense. Which is fine, and I should have been smarter about that. But, as someone who doesn't know football well, trying to play this game for the first time, just because it looks cool, it looks fun. They're not going to know that. And I, I think that's, that's a design... Like, the game needs a little bit more of... It needs to know down and distance. And now the onside kick that's, you know, get 15 yards, 10 yards, I'm gonna get 15 yards, 4th and 15. Sea Striker with his second sack. Walker, that's called the quarterback. And he was looking to pass, so. Um, yeah, I definitely think that's something the game needs a little better on is down the distance understanding for play calling, like suggested play calling. Um, but yeah, beyond that, I think the game is great. Just, just minor things. Again, just minor things. Uh, I'm not gonna sit and say the game is, you know, oh that kills the game for me. It's just little things, you know. That I think, but hey, you know what? The game was a blast. I'm having fun. It's been awesome, even if I do grab every once in a while. So yeah. Andy White told me I should start blaming the players more and start blaming myself for my mistakes. And you know what? Probably had to start doing that. Because <laughs> I can't be held accountable for any of this crap. Uh, good coming in there. Uh, Miles is just to pack the load here. I kind of want to stretch this score back out. Oh, spin move. Good in with the touchdown. All right. Hey, we're back up. Apparently, I just need to run the ball the entire day. I guess I'm trying to force those passes. I think that's actually more of what's happening than anything. Just trying to force those passes. It's like, better decision made. Oh, he shanked that one, and that's no good. He did well, and then now he's now he's missed two. Well, I guess there's a new kicker next year. Uh, just definitely get a new kicker next time. Because uh, <laughs> Dawson's not good. He just shanked that one off the off his foot. Oh, Samson coming up, making the play. Oh, not Samson. Uh, actually, I think it was Samson on Samson there. Their locks are flowing. Oh! Anoni! Diving there. What in the world has happened? Uh, I don't know what happened there, but that didn't make any sense. Six, five, four. Oh, one more point. They're actually going to snap it. Oh, somebody catch it! No! Had a chance that like four guys put their hands on that ball and nobody come up with it. But Oh well. Hey, right, that's the ball game. And with the final score, 17 to 36, the Lexington Racers outlast the Coyotes of Kansas City. It took me a second. Uh in this contest here in Lexington. We had 13 first downs to their seven. 
417 total yards, 104 passing yards. No shock on that one. They beat us by about 100. Uh, they're averaging 8 yards per attempt. We're averaging 5, worse than we normally do. Uh, 313 rushing yards, though, for 12 yards a carry. So solid. Should have ran that more. Definitely should have ran that more. Four punt returns for 62 yards. Two kick returns. No turnovers. No penalties. Haven't seen a penalty all season. Player of the game. Again, zeros. Third time's the charm. 18 rushing, 18 rushing attempts for 217 yards. 12. <laughs> he had almost as many yards as the entire opposing team. Uh... 12 yards of carry, 36 on the long, two touchdowns. He had that fumble. Gotta stop those spin moves. Racked in uh, 32 fantasy points. You had him in this week. You won big. Uh, player stats for the game. Indy wise, 78.6 rating. 11 for 22 with 50% completion. Eh, he's had worse. He's had worse. Four, 104 yards, 5 yards attempt, 1 touchdown on that weird, I have no idea how, tipped pass to Rivera. Uh, long of 22, 8 fantasy points. Rushing, again, Zeros, 18 for 20, 217. Miles, 6 attempts for 87 yards, 14 average, 100, or 29 yards the longest, and a TD. 20 range points, good back if you got him too. Good, 1 rush for 10 yards for a touchdown, averaging 10 yards a carry, solid. Kruger had that 1 run, we gave him the ball 1 time as our fullback, and he got us negative 3 yards. And then Indy White, first run of the season for 2 yards. Receiving, leading the day, Miles uh, with receptions for three for 21 yards, seven per average, zero touchdowns, three targets, zero drops. Reaver, two targets, or two two receptions for 28 yards, 14 per, per reception, along with 22. Uh, five targets, two drops, five fantasy points. Rivera, two, two receptions, 31 yards, and that miraculous TD. Two targets, no drops. Snow, one reception for four yards. Pete, one reception, three yards, two targets, one drop. Kruger, one reception, four yards. Good, one reception, 13 yards. And Zeros, two on the miss. Sock, three targets, no catches. McMahon, one target, one drop. Yeah, he had it. He had it wide open, too. Ricky should have gotten cut. Defense, leading the defense today was actually Stevenson with five and two Plastiflex. Atkinson also with five. And Anoni with three and a tackle for loss. Beard had two tackles and four pass deflections. Dude's killing it. McCall, two tackles, one tackle for loss and one pass deflection. Galvin, one, two tackles, one for loss. Z Striker coming up there, two tackles, two for loss, one sack. That's a bunch of crap. He had two, but they're only giving credit for one. And Heath, one tackle. Henry, one tackle. Evans, one tackle. Clayton, one tackle. Kemp, one sack. Tackle for loss. Reaver, None. Omakadan, one pass deflection. Uh, he had several hurries. Uh, we really got into the quarterback. Uh, I wish I had a, I wish I had a QB hurry stat, but they don't. But yeah, definitely seeing some guys get after it. Uh, Reaver recovering that fumble. Uh, thank God. Kicking. Donaldson, one for one on field goals. Uh, we'll keep that early one on. A long 23, but he was three for five on extra points. Punting. Ro Robles only had one punt. 42 yards average. Side over two returns for 21 yards. Not great. Punt returns for 62. So solid with a long of 29. Uh, not been great. Not been terrible. But that is going to be our game for this one. Pretty solid game. Played well. If I'd have ran the ball more to start the start the session, to start the game, would have been great. Kansas City dropping to 1-3. We're standing at 4-0. Shocking. Everybody. Simmer for the rest of the week. And... Notable games. Um, Arizona. Not notable games. Uh, Scorpions dropping Seattle. Not a big deal. Let's see. Any major teams losing? Just go. No. Games are all pretty much played out the way they thought they'd play out. 2 and 2, 1 and 3, 3 and 1, 2 and 2, 0 and 4. Dropping Dallas to 0 and 4. This season, wow. Uh, New e the Empire, 0-4. Uh, yeah, that looks about right. So, new Shepard clipping this week. Gilmore on top with 307 kick return yards. Holy cow. Beavers stand at 2-2 two two in the Mountain Division. So, yeah. Next week, we will play Chicago Blues. 
let's go back out here and let's look at the facilities. We just got done building, what was it? What did we just finish? Uh, we just finished building the road, we built the rowing machine and I think we got a fast food store. So yeah, uh, next, I might do a rehab facility. Strength, stamina, and speed. Ooh. A test positive for illegal drug uses of drugs cause a decrease. I tell you what, boys and girls, we're going to pause this one right here. So down in the comments, let me know. Should we give supplements and drugs to our players? I mean, the Lexington uh, Racers football field has a full functioning horse racetrack around the outside. Do we get some horse meds, some horse stimulants or something like that? Let me know down in the comments. We'll find out. Uh, it's strength, speed, and stamina are 15%. Pretty solid. Um, yeah. It's a risk. I don't know what the percentage of the risk is. But uh, yeah, so let me know down in the comments. Do we give them drugs or not? Uh... So, you know, leave your comment. We'll see. I'll, uh, I'll ask around, and we'll come to a decision on whether or not we drug up our players or not. But anyway, thank you all for catching this one. We'll catch you all next time.